they kind of they pick up uh, finding out that that Harry needs a kidney to survive, and and then they find out that he might have had a child, and so instead of the obvious uh, choice of looking for that child so that you, you can make a soul connection for the rest of your life and and uh, and have that family feeling, uh, they're focused on really getting that kidney, you know, getting that kid <laughs> that compatible kidney, and. Uh, and then love happens afterwards. The beauty of the characters is, like real friends, when it comes to a woman, you know, you, there's no rules, man. You know, we're going to screw each other completely, you know, and that's the fun of it. It's like, we, you know, my character is so insanely selfish that it's so much fun to play, to always make the selfish choice. doing this because of the requests of millions of people that never leave me alone about it you know I mean my Twitter is just like you know there's five tweets about something else and like three tweets about Dumb and Dumber you know they want to see it you know so it, it just de definitely got inside people and became a part of their lives I was just uh, meeting a family today on the set that was like you know the the little boy was maybe I don't know, 10 years old or something like that and he had just seen Dumb and Dumber a couple of months ago and his parents were total fans of Dumb and Dumber. So it keeps reintroducing itself to, to new generations of people. And that's just a real thrill. Jeff, by the way, is so much fun to play with because he'll go there. He's totally committed. You know, he gets it, the fact that a movie like this is not about talking about what happens. You know, it's about setting up things and, and playing them out to the fullest to where an audience goes, I can't believe they're doing that. Good old Freda Felcher is, is the mother of this child. Uh, fortunately, insanely uh, uh, um, fortunately, uh, Kathleen Turner is playing that character which I could not believe that she was, she was wanting to do that, and I was, I was so stoked to do that with her. You know, we did uh, Peggy Sue Got Married years ago, and, uh, and you know, to come around again and have her do that, it, have her be a part of this is really a thrill. We've always had kind of a really good uh, energy together. You know, when we sit creatively together, it's like they're, they're fantastic on their own, but when somehow the three of us get together and we start jamming on the script and stuff, we just, we had forgotten how much fun it was when they came to the house and we, we went through the whole script and punched things up and had, had some fun thinking of crazy stuff. And, uh, and it was just so much fun. It was like, why aren't we doing this all the time? This is fantastic. Yeah. We really missed it.